Why, hello, Saw. Good to have you back. You! Care to explain why you left us behind? Oh, Book, I've been on a scent cleanse. Scent cleanse. You know, pushing the good smells in so you be, the, the bad smells go out. It's been working really well. All the words I say are my own choice now. I told Lollipop and Taco I was gone. I thought they would tell the rest of you. Well, Taco's being shunned right now, and Lollipop just likes to know more than everyone else. So, yeah. Also, hey, Saw. Hi, Kate! Uh, you okay? I feel great! Are you absolutely positive those fumes are out of your system? Um, yeah. All my number-yelling urges are completely sated! In today's video, we're going to be making Saw and Gady. As always, let me know what I should make next, and check out our Discord server for other crafts and templates. Cut out the piece, leaving some margin around it, as you'll be cutting it from the cardboard. The cardboard I'm using is about this thick. Go around all the edges with the right color. The top edges may fray outwards a bit, so you'll just have to push them inwards.
Now glue the limbs in place. You probably didn't need this much glue, but add it enough so it stays in place. Now you may want to push these cardboard edges so they're at least flush with the paper's edge so once you glue the front face, none of the cardboard is showing. I did update the template so it has two small placement guides for the yellow hinges. Bend the legs and draw in a face to finish your gaiety. I decided to add the two different colored bodies as well as a few different handles and the Dora covering the top because I couldn't leave that one out. The parts are designed with being able to fold them and then cutting out both of the sides at the same time and that somewhat worked for lining them up but you could just cut each side individually if it's easier for you.
for the Dora handle, you're going to want to cut out just this front pieces part right here so it can look how it's supposed to. You're going to glue the two sets together, but only from the limbs, like this, as you don't want any glue where the head is, otherwise they won't be able to go onto the saw body. As you can see, you're going to want to mark out where the saw body is able to go so it has enough room to fit once it's glued together. Carefully cut it out to finish your Dora handle. and then bend the limbs and draw on a face to finish your own saw figure. Thanks for watching and like the video to let me know you like these types of crafts. And as always, let me know what I should make next. Run it by me again? Okay, so, <gasps> I like being green. Uh-huh, and I like being too.